Hey everybody, welcome to All Outdoors. Thanks for stopping by. Well, we're out here in the backyard, relaxing a little bit. It's July 1st, it's Canada's Day, and it's our 150th anniversary. So, to all of my Canadian friends out there, happy Canada's Day. Now, today's video is a huge mail call that just kind of caught up on me and I was camping and doing things around the house and everyday living type stuff and uh, kind of got behind on some stuff and so today I'm gonna take care of it. The first mail call came from somebody everybody knows and if you can tell came from Josh down at Frog Tide Tent site Sanctuary I had sent him down a uh, a neck knife chain that I made and uh, as you all know he's got some uh, medical problems uh, as well as a lot of us do me included he no longer needed a uh, knee brace that he used to wear and offered it up and I jumped on that to help me get around easier. So Josh, I thank you for sending that up to me and when I opened the box, of course in patented frog tack style, I got a nice big chunk of chaga. I got a chunk of batwood, very nice color. I got this, which I thought was cool, that's going to be going in my truck, is the hook knife seat belt cutter. So I'm going to be putting that in my truck kit. And just a mountain, okay, not a mountain, a donut. Of 550 paracord. So I'd like to thank Josh for sending that stuff up to me. Really appreciate it, buddy. The extras were really nice. Oh, yeah. Since I got it, I've been carrying it. Another thing that came in the box is a Swiss Army knife. Single blade. I love it. It's been in my pocket ever since I got it. The next one comes from another guy down in the States who's really popular on YouTube, Nathan4071. Uh, Nathan and I, I'd sent him down something from Canada here, uh, a finger slide bottle opener because, you know, Nathan likes his beer. And when he got it, he kindly offered me a barrel rod. So, when he said that, I looked through everything on his on his eBay account and through his videos and stuff like that. And the one that he made to donate for Aaron Nelson's uh, prize came in the mail this past week. I got the six inch by three quarter inch. And he sent me the high steel striker to go with it. So when I get out into the shop again and decide what wood I'm going to use, I'm going to be making handles for these and I'll be showing them off too. So thank you very much, Nathan. Really appreciate it. Always wanted one of your world renowned barrel rods, so now I got one. Thanks a lot. And the last one comes from Brian Lee down at Cape Fear. And the Fatwood Emporium. Uh, Nathan, er, Nathan, yeah, Brian was having a 400 sub giveaway. And when he did the patented arrow shot, it landed on 
Diane from Snowfog Outdoors. And little did I know that Diane had paid it forward to me. So you can imagine my shock when Brian messaged me and said I won. When I went to watch the video is when I found out that Diane won and paid it forward to me. So, Diane, thank you very much. And you will get it back. You know I'm going to get you back. And I got it back through the mail. I got a nice little note from Brian. It's got his personal business card on it too, so that'll be going in my... Uh, I kind of like to keep some of these private. I like the handwritten notes. One of the first things that was in the box was a bag full of his fire starters. They're wax dip. They're the uh, circular pads and there are just, a, I think there's 50 in here. Like I'm never going to need these ever again. But very cool piece. The other thing that was in there was the Les Strauss Camillus Camels. Yeah. Saw. And it actually comes in its own sheath. And it comes with a little barrel rod too. So I'm going to be mounting this on my pattern 82 rucksack. So this will have a home on my rucksack, on my pattern 82 Canadian rucksack. And I think that's where it's going to stay too. So that's another piece that came in. One thing that I really like, one of the Hudson Bay style flint strikers. Very cool. Going in my kit. the bundle of sweet, sweet batwood wrapped in the 550 fire cord. You can actually see the fire line in there. Let's see if you guys can see that. And there was, of course, something that I didn't have yet. I got the big fat wood emporium decals for my board and they'll be going up on there soon. I also got one of Brian's business cards from the fat wood emporium. I'm going to be happy to uh, make a business card holder now too. And then, as a bonus, all you guys watch Brian go out, of, go out in the bush there and bring home that big orange log of sweet wood, fat wood. And how he cut it up and split it up and everything like that. Well, in the note he said that I would get a bonus. That he wanted to put a bonus in the prize pack. And the bonus was three great big hunks of that wood that he got from that. Like, you guys gotta see this. Like, look at the color in that. Like, this stuff is out of this world. So, Brian and Diane, I thank you very much. I'm going to be leaving the links 
to everybody that I mentioned their YouTube channels in the description box below. I hope everybody's having a good weekend. And of course, you know me, you gotta have my Timmy's. And of course, it's in a Canadian 150 cup. So I'd like to thank everybody. Uh, Brian from the Fatwood Emporium. Go check out the Fatwood Emporium. Josh from Protect Sanctuary. Go check him out. Nathan4071. You've all probably checked him out, but if you haven't, go check him out. He is the Feral Rod King. And Diane from the Snowfog Outdoors. Go check her out. Great gal. And I think that's going to do it for this time. Once again, happy Canada's Day to everybody. And always remember safe, be careful, and enjoy your dirt time. Thanks guys.